I don't know. I think I, um, I might take a break in a bit to go get some dinner, you know? Um, but I don't want to end the stream because we've been, it's been a lot of fun. We've gotten a lot of good stuff done. Meanwhile, speaking of stuff, getting stuff done. Oh, look at that. More uh, stuff is starting to go through. Okay. All right, so they got an air, which is what really what I was waiting for. Um, since they got an air, I'm going to start doing some wars. Um, which... Mm, I think I feel like Lithuania might actually be a good one. Start feeding the Ruthenian land to... Uh, to Kiev, you know. Either that or Wallachia. Both of those could be good. Both of them could be good. Um, I feel like out of those two. Um, oh, and look at that. Aragon did finish and integrating stuff. Wait, they have... Oh, it's just Navarro. Okay. Hmm... Unfortunately, we can't get the Conquer Bulgaria thing done until we get Bodoni, and uh, that's going to be a while. Gosh darn, that sucks that um, we're not going to be able to get that right away. Hmm, okay. Well, either way, like, I don't know, like, there's no way Hungary can sell it to us or anything. Gosh darn, that's annoying. Hmm. Well, for now, let's just focus on uh, focus on other things. So, I guess uh, the I guess the the Lithuania would probably be more useful right now. It's gonna be easier for sure. So. Mm -hmm. Um, and yeah, again, Ruthenian land, basically, is how we're gonna try to divide it up. Hmm. Okay. Alright, Lithuania, I'm gonna go ahead and, um, declare on you, bud. Okay, let's do this. See what we can do. Ah, oh, darn. So that's what I was worried about, is that we might be going too slow. Because so I want to try to get these before Galicia Bohemia gets some, but either way, it's, it's fine. We'll just conquer it from them, you know? So that's also fine. Okay, you guys go up there to the capital. Okay. Go ahead and uh, get a castle building. Again, I think we're going to do Travunia or or um, I don't know. One of the two. And then I feel like we so I do want to do this one. Let's let's just look at this real quick. So if we do hum 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 uh, I feel like that might actually be better than Trevunia. Now I'm looking at it. It covers all this area. And then we would just need one to cover other areas. Hmm. So if we do that. Maybe Nice? 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 That would cover everything else. Hmm, I feel like that might work. Kosovo could actually be fine. Actually, yeah, you know what? I think you're right. I think Kosovo, even though it's not mountains, I, I think Kosovo will probably be fine. Hmm, what about rivers? 
So that's that's one thing though, is that the rivers are not as good there. I like this, because there's a lot of river crossing penalties. <clears throat> yeah, and the only downside there is that then it kind of overlaps with Plovdiv, which I also want to make a fort. Um, I guess we don't need to do Plovdiv. We could just do Nice and have just that kind of covering a lot of stuff for now. Maybe I'm overthinking it. You know, I'm, I'm probably almost certainly am. No, you know, I think I'm going to go back on I'm going to go and do what I was thinking originally. I changed my mind. We're probably going to take over a siege from some rebels. Uh, that's unfortunate. Still fine, though. Um, I'm going to take you back down here. Actually, hold on. We might need some help there. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe we'll be fine. Oh, we already won. Okay, never mind. Go back. fight them in, with a defensive terrain. Alright, I think this is fine. So let's go ahead and peace out. Uh, Ruthenian land goes to Kiev. Ruthenian land. Oh, Ruthenian land goes to Kiev. Ruthenian land. It goes to Kiev. This province, Ruthenian, goes to Kiev. This is not Ruthenian. This is not Ruthenian. Yeah, this is actually basically the northern border. Is uh, where Galicia... Galicia Volhynia, once they get all that stuff back, that'll be what we need from them, so... Yeah, alright, cool, let's go ahead and just take what we need and get out. I'm not gonna take more than I need, um, especially because we are kind of on the edge of a coalition. A minor one, but still one nonetheless. Yeah, go ahead and take out. Cool, Kiev is looking pretty darn big, which is pretty awesome. Okay, cool. Oh, wow, Georgia's preparing to attack those? Okay. Again, not many people are even going to care if we if we take over um, Wallachia, because they're orthodox. So everyone else is like, whatever. <laughs> sure, it'll endanger us eventually, but not right now, so who cares? Um, that's basically what they they think, probably. Go ahead and switch that out and get rid of the old one. Easy money. Okay, we got those cored up now. A lot of good stuff going on right now. A lot of good stuff. Whoo do 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 Hmm. Alright, yep, there's George declaring on the Ottomans. Yeah, I mean, I feel like we should do this soon. Before they get more allies, you know? Korean land directly at some point, I would like to, but, um, <clears throat> yeah. Oh gosh, I got caught up there. Mm 
Okay, what else do we want to be doing here? That's good, but we need to catch up on Diplo, unfortunately. I actually feel like maybe we should, um, buff this guy. What do you mean, what do you mean, Ernst? Is something wrong with, uh, with Poland, Lithuania area? Is, <laughs> what, uh, what, is something out of the ordinary here? I, I don't see anything wrong with this area. <laughs> also, Ernst, look at this. Look at this. You see that dynasty name? In Muscovy? Look at that, bud. How do you like me now? Oh, man. This campaign is ridiculous. This is a ridiculous game. Mmm. So, uh, let me fill in on what's happened briefly. Basically, Poland, well, so Poland and Lithuania never actually joined up together. They were allied. Muscovy basically destroyed them. They had a coalition that destroyed them. Um, and then, uh, and then they basically just collapsed. Lithuania and Poland both had, like, civil wars at the same time. Rebels popped out Galicia, Vol Volhynia, Kiev, and Chernigov. I vassalized Kiev, and now I'm going to feed them all of Ruthenia. And basically, they're going to be a perma-vassal that I keep around to shield me from Poland and Scandinavia, whoever... Uh, Muscovy, if things go bad between us. Although I, I'm hoping we get a PU, which would be even better. But, uh, but I'm, I think Kiev is going to be a perma vassal. Oh, Moldavia also popped out of Poland, had no allies, so I picked them up. I'll probably annex them. I'll annex them soon. Um, I'm mostly I'm going to keep Kiev, but Moldavia I want obviously. So um, Moldavia is a much better province, and uh, I want to make Romanian promoted, so that works for that. Anywho, yeah. A lot of good stuff happening. And so soon we're going to go ahead and go to war with uh, Chernigov and Galicia Volhynia as well. But for right now, I'm not worried about it. Okay, so. We're about to go to war with Wallachia. Wallachia. The Volux. No. Is their army even here? Yeah, it is. Hey, hungry. Really? Really, you wankers? Alright, fair. Fair, fair, fair. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what this is what I that's what I thought. Mm-hmm. Really, they're actually going there. Okay. Fair. It's farmlands, I don't care. Boom! Get wrecked, young. Stack wiped, huh? Yeah, no, that's a uh, no surprise there. Man, we're just destroying everyone. It's great. It's great. Mm-hmm. Columbian Exchange, okay. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Ottomans is another target that we'll probably go after soon. Karaman as well, but they're allied to the Mamluks, you know? That's the main thing. Oh, hey, they'll actually almost do it. Hmm. In fact, once we get rid of our uh, negative modifier here, they might. Huh. Okay, in about a month. We'll check again. What rank are we now? Sixth. Yeah, look at that. That's nice. Nice, baby. Nice. Okay, and the Age of Reformation is here. Age of Reformation is definitely a pretty good one. Yeah, I like this age. Um, Pass Blasphemy Act. Tolerance of Heretics. So, Catholics. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to do it. I think it's fine. We really need more missionary strength anyway, so yeah. What is our state limit at right now? 23 and we have 9. Holy crap, we need to make more states. We will at some point. We will. Oh, 
so close. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't need to call anyone in, I don't think. Okay. What is the... Reestablish the theme system. Where is that? Yeah, basically all of the Anatolia, huh? Hmm. Alright, okay, that's going to be a little more difficult. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's fine. Hmm. Alright, we need to build more forts. Um, I also think I wanted to do, like, Mentese to cover here, and then Huda Vendigir. Yeah, I think that's good. Let's just do one of those there. You know, resituating our forts. That's good. Mm-hmm. Ohio was destroyed from the storm. I heard there was a storm going up that way. That's not good. I hope everything's okay there. You know, at least for you. Hmm. Oh, I forgot. I could have gotten one last free war taxes and I didn't. Because I'm a dummy. I'm going to get war taxes anyways, honestly. We have a lot of prestige, so I don't mind doing that. Oh, it's so close, because they have so much. Uh, I was just saying, I hope you're okay. I hope everything's okay with you, at least. Mm-hmm. So we don't want to do that, I don't think, but... I don't know, Georgia. Good. Okay, so there's that. That's good. Let's go ahead and... Um, I feel like I want to try to get Imareti and feed it to, uh, what's it called? What's the face, you know. You know, the thing, the thing and all the stuff, you know. Yeah, I got you, man. after this. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Uh, maybe Chernigov and Galicia Vol Volhynia, you know? That could be, you know, maybe do that instead. I don't know. Either way, we certainly have options. start feeding Trebizond more of the Black Sea coast. At least the stuff up here. I don't know, you know? I do not know exactly what they want to do. <laughs> okay, we have these two forts now. Uh, at some point, I'm going to delete the one in our capital, but, um, but it's, it's, well, I don't know, I might keep it. Galicia Volhynia is planning to attack Lithuania. Really? Wow. Wow. Did not necessarily expect that. Hmm. <clears throat> Mm 
At some point, we should go to war with uh, with Georgia as well. Or I was Circassia. That'd be good. That'd be good. Let's go to war with Georgia and Circassia alone. Feed Trebizond a bunch of stuff there before we start annexing them. That would be a pretty good war, I would think. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, someone pieced out. Karaman. Wow, I think the Ottomans are actually going to be completely destroyed after this. I think there's a good chance that we see them get completely destroyed. Jeez. Karaman is actually kind of strong now, and this is what I was worried about, is that I would maybe, you know, wait too long and have this happen. So that's unfortunate, but, you know, nothing I can really do about it now. Yep, yep, look at that. Ottomans are pretty much dead. Not completely, but pretty much. And Crimea is free now. Which is, uh, not good exactly. I don't know. I don't know what to think of it. I feel like Georgia is, uh, maybe our next war. Alba Circassia. Everyone's calling off at work, yeah. Yeah, it's just been raining here today, but... Let's do a reconquest. Yeah, I'm gonna do this now. Beautiful. Um, okay, yeah, let's do this. Do, 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 do. Okay, cool. So then, with that being said, we could peace out of this other war. So that goes to Trebizond. This is going to be a bit of aggressive expansion. I'm a little worried about it, but I'm not too worried. Well, maybe we, maybe we don't take this. No, we should. We're already over here. Let's do it. I'm a little worried about... Liberty desire, but nah, I think I think it's gonna be fine. So, all right, what about this war? This is the one I think might hurt us. Ooh, yeah. See, that's a lot, right? Um, that is, I think, too much. We have a truce with Lithuania, though. We have a truce with a lot of those people, and Ottomans are really weak now. Obviously, Venice is real weak. It, a lot of them are very weak, but it's still, I still feel like maybe, maybe we go a little lighter on it, on how you know, not take quite so much. Like, that seems alright. Or maybe take everything except for that capital? It, yeah, that's... Yeah. <laughs> All three of those add up to less than the capital, so... Uh, maybe we don't even take that one either. Just take these two. You know, we, we take our time. Take our time. Hey, MJ Halevi. What's up? Welcome back. Uh, I think we're gonna go for uh, for Mari Nostrum after this, you know, um, like uh, once we get the uh, the Basilius achievement or whatever. Uh, we're gonna try to do, go as far as we can, you know. I think. Um, yeah. All right, there we go. And the other thing is, we're probably not gonna have a coalition either way because we do have Muscovy and Austria, and Austria has Hungary and Bohemia, so <laughs> we're in pretty good shoot, in pretty good hands, I think. Okay, I want you to, yeah, go back up that way. Chase down that army if you can. This war should not be hard. I'm just worried about the Earth's expansion that's going to come with it. But, uh, you know, we'll do our best. Hold on, I want to check something real quick. I'm going I'm to check my Twitter feed real quick.
Give me a second. Give me a moment here. I'm just going to look at something on Twitter. Hmm. Okay, never mind. You know, they can't see the road. That's not good. Okay. Now see he's getting bigger, which is good. It would be even better if we could, uh, if it allows us to get a PU over them. And it may, it may indeed. Ottomans have been reduced to two provinces. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful sight. One of the most beautiful. It's rare that you ever see the Ottomans completely destroyed, right? So normally they hang on, even if you tear them apart, they hang on with a couple provinces and they keep moving, going further and further. So I don't know. There's something satisfying about seeing them completely destroyed. I'm gonna, I want to set this uh, for Trebizond. Hey, Kiev, can you get that one, bud? Thanks. Or not. I think I'm gonna do that. Speed things up a bit. Same with Trebizond. Okay, boom. Okay. Alright, and let's see what we can do here. This Byzantium is so satisfying to look at. I love it so much. Ah, oh, darn. We're not going to be able to break that alliance with them, unfortunately. But uh, maybe we could find a way to when, when Mamluks wouldn't defend them. I don't know. Maybe not. Aragon is terrifying, man. Okay, there's Trebizond. Beautiful. It's very good. Mm-hmm. Okay, meanwhile, so I want to transfer this to Trebizond. I don't care about conquering everything right now, but I want to I want to conquer the coastline is mostly what it comes down to. Uh, and then I'll, and once I get the coastline, then I will annex uh, Trebizond. Yeah, we'll probably be at war a little while longer. So, um, guys in the chat, what do you guys got planned for tonight? Because I'm, I'm thinking if you guys are planning on hanging out here a while, I do need to eat. But I, what I'm thinking is maybe I take a quick break, go get some food, and then come back. Um, and just leave the, the overlay up or something. Play some music. I don't know. What do you guys, uh, do you guys have a preference? Or do you guys have to go soon anyways? If so, maybe I'll just wrap it up. But, you know. I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Wow, that was sexist. What was sexist, Lemur? <laughs> You're silly. <laughs> you said guys? Yeah. Yeah, guys is, uh, is gender neutral, you know? Just like dude, you know? Yeah, I can't go anywhere anyways, so that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Okay. 
I think we're pretty much ready to peace out. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna peace out now before they start getting more of that stuff back. Um, let's go ahead and do Trebizond. Trebizond. And Trebizond. That will be ours. Cool. We're gonna take some stuff directly, you best believe. Let's see how much it is overall first. I'm worried. I'm worried. Ooh, that's pretty nasty. That's it. That is pretty nasty, but I think I'm gonna do it and then just sit for a while. Because this is a good opportunity, right? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I know. I know. It connects up our lands, right? So it's... Well, except for Crimea, but... Other than that, it connects up our lands. I can get rid of their alliance here, so that next war will be easier. There we go. Boom. I can just ping in the Discord when I get back. Yep. I might do that, yeah. Okay. Okay, there's that. So Trebizond gets some more land there, connects up a bunch of their land. And then Georgia... I think eh, that's that's a lot. That's a lot, but I don't think uh, I don't think we're gonna have any trouble with it. Basically, I don't feel like any of those people would even join against us, um, let alone actually declare. And if they do declare, we have Muscovy, we have Austria. I think we'll be fine. Um, and it helps because we just get a lot of the stuff that we just want right now that I don't feel like waiting for. Mm-hmm. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful, Lally. Beautiful. Um, so I think I'll probably actually uh, annex Trebizond soon. Mmm, this one. Uh, this one is always tough. I think... What about... So the administrative free policy normally sucks, because we don't normally have any. But this time we might, because I don't know. Let's see. Well, so administrative ideas with influence is an admin idea, uh, admin policy. And then... So that one would be good, but you have one free one anyway. So unless we have another one... Humanist is probably the next one after that. Humanist and influence, but that's a diplo. Humanist and no, none of those. Or religious is the other one. No, I don't think so. No, I don't think that would actually be that good. Normally it isn't. So let's discount this one. Um, the nobility, leader cost, or the advisor cost. I think the advisor cost, and I normally do this one. I think we're gonna do it again. So yeah, all right. there to deal with all those rebels that are inevitably going to spawn. Okay. Well, so I think for now, we're just going to chill for a bit, recover, get some uh, aggressive expansion down, build up some more stuff, you know, lots of stuff going on here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. I think I'm going to mothball all of our forts, but leave our army maintenance up. I think that's going to be the protocol here. Uh, I think we also want to build a um, our other fort in Mentese. Yep. There we go. Okay. Mothball the Navy too, might as well. 
trying to save some on some cost. Oh, religious civil disorder in like a bunch of places at once. Wow. Okay, cool. Look at the orthodox block it has gotten stronger. It's beautiful. Mm-hmm. I do think we want to make Serbian a promoted culture. Uh, although Bulgarian could even be better, to be fair. Um, but uh, well, let's actually just look at it, kind of eyeball it. Um, I think Serbian is actually about the same as Bulgarian. Um, but uh, we're going to be—we already have all the Bulgarian land except for one, so I'd rather do Serbian. It'll help with more conquests in the future, you know. Um, and we can convert Albanian to it right away. So yeah, I think we do Serbian, make Serbian a promoted culture. Um, Cause why not? How many promoted cultures do we have right now? Five slots, that's a lot, wow. Um, and beyond that, so we're gonna have Romanian is gonna be one soon. Neapolitan, Egypt. we have plenty for now. So I think we're gonna go ahead and do Serbian. Um, to do so, we need to go ahead and... Oh, it also has Kosovo anyway, so... Yeah. Yeah, I think that works. Let's go ahead and do this. Find... Oh, Serbian. Make Serbian promoted. I think that'll be good. Okay. I also think we want to make Wallachia a state. Absolutely, we do. Uh, and we want to make Romanian a promoted culture, definitely, as well. Because even though it's not a ton right now, we're about to get a bunch more development when we finish annexing them. A lot more. Uh, and Tirgoviste, and, uh, and it's just good. And we're going to convert Transylvanian and stuff to that eventually. So, yep, we'll go ahead and do that. Um, make Romanian a promoted culture. Yeah. I'll probably won't do Bulgarian. I'll probably just con convert Bulgarian to Serbian or Greek or whatever. So, yeah. I think that works. Well, we eclipsed Poland already. Jeez. This is crazy, man. It's ridiculous how quickly we've gained power and people around us have all been freaking destroyed. Um, Thrace gets local. That's, that's this area, right? So we could actually convert Bulgarian now. Um, not that that's a huge deal, but, you know. Let's try it. Why not? Let's do it now. Why not? Okay, cool. <clears throat> Trebizond is looking all right. Um, oh, hey, and Crimea actually got back a province that we would like to take from them. Again, my dude, I want you to get me... <laughs> get me more claims, you know? Hmm. They're still working on cores right now, so that's fair. <clears throat> I think it's about time that we go ahead and upgrade our armies, um, especially because that will help prevent any coalitions as well. Do we... <sighs> hmm. I guess the other option is that we could make a third 20 stack, and that's not a terrible idea. So... Yeah, you know what? I think that's what I'm going to do. <clears throat> that seems fine. Do -do -do -do. Right, truce with Ragusa and everyone there has ended. Uh, that is a sign that we should go ahead and start fabricating again. Mm -hmm. Luckily, the stuff down here... So Trebizond got their core back, um, which is nice. Did they make their capital there again? Yeah, they did. Uh, this stuff is all Turkish, so it is um, going pretty quickly, and that's nice. We're doing pretty well on military. Truce with Moldavia, yeah, whatever. Obviously that doesn't matter. We border the Ottomans here. They're allied to who? To Ajam, who's pretty far away actually, but decent size. Hmm. 
I really want to just finish off the Ottomans. I want to be the one that does it myself, you know? I would love to finish off the Ottomans myself. Um, I'm almost wondering if maybe I want to make like a a Georgian perma vassal as well. Like maybe Akun. Well, we have claims on. Uh, where do we have claims up to? Up to there, actually. So maybe we release. Armenia and make an Armenian vassal. That actually seems pretty reasonable to me. Yeah, that seems good. Release an Armenian vassal at some point, have them be in the, all the rest of the Caucasus that we don't want. That seems fine. It's already 15, it's only 1515, and we're already thinking about like, ooh, perma vassal here, perma vassal here, because we spread so quickly, so rapidly. It's crazy. Okay, um, Reformed has just spawned. Oh yeah, no problem, Mercy. Thanks for hanging out, bud. Thanks for hanging out. Always appreciated. What have I been doing? 12-4-4? Oh, uh, the one too many Cav. <clears throat> yeah, see you, Ernsty. I'll see you. Have fun. Gosh darn it, Trevizon. Get some claims. That's a pretty good amount of, I think. What is this? Oh! Oh wow, we're gonna get one of those texts down, and I have no idea which one it was. Not that one. Was it military? Yeah, it was, wow, okay. Good. Oh wow, This I did not realize this province is 21 development, holy crap, hmm. We definitely need to take admin ideas, because we're gonna have so many states eventually. This is going to be a good state as well. Eastern Adriatic. Absolutely going to be a good one. Um, do we want to do it right now, though? Probably. It'll allow us to convert it, probably. What com What are we converting right now, anyways? It's making progress. Okay. Yeah. Darn it, man. I need I need claims on Crimea. I need claims on Crimea. No CB. Rebels? No. Hmm. Okay. There we go. Look at that. I think our fort situation is pretty good, actually. About what I would uh, say is ideal for right now. Move some stuff around, but uh, have the same number roughly, I think. Um, oh, Austria, why? Why is Austria losing their status? I mean, I guess it's because it's all like, um, it's, it's not directly owned by them, but still, you would think that they would be more powerful. Higher up in the rankings. And at some point, we want to go to war with Aragon, but that's going to be a ways off, I think. <laughs> Definitely going to be a ways off. Um, eight, seven, eight. 
Not a lot of great provinces here, but, you know. Yeah, I think we're going to focus on eastward and... Yeah, eastward expansion and southward expansion, really, for now. Mamluks at some point in time, Karaman. We really want to get Karaman, but... But I really don't want to have to fight them with the Mamluks as well. I'd really like to avoid that. But, you know, at some point we got to figure out something. Olakian Separatists should be fine. Ultenia, we can actually avoid those, I think. Okay, Trebizond has gotten two claims now. Good. And that pretty much means that we should be good. Let's wait a little bit and then go over there and smash them. Okay. I'm glad that my computer hasn't crashed this stream. Knock on wood. Okay, well, Lockean Separatists apparently still want to fire, so whatever. I'm just going to go ahead and get ready for this war. We're going to go to war with Crimea. Again, we have a lot of aggressive expansion, but um, at this point, it's not going to matter. The people who could join are still going to be able to join. Um, so it's kind of more like we're just trying to outpace them at this point. So, uh, with that being the case, I definitely think it's going to be worth it to go over here and go ahead and Try to take them out. Muscovy is conquering more stuff constantly, which is good. As long as they don't intrude on my territory, which they haven't yet. Chernigov and Galicia, Bohemia are hideous looking. I hate it. The border gore is terrible, but, you know, it, you know, the area is we weakened up. <laughs> so at the very least, that is a positive. All right, we're going to go and declare on these guys, these mofos. No, oh, wow, they're about to attack Poland, too. Jeez. It's crazy. Crazy good. No. Um. Mm-hmm. They're pretty much trapped, so not much to worry about here, I don't think. Literally just gotta wait until this war is over. Mm-hmm. Keep them trapped. Yep, there you go. Oh no, we lost our general. Rip. War is basically done. Booyah. Let's go, boys. Okay. So, with this being done now. Hmm. Oh, okay. So they have a queen regent right now. Ooh, they, it's possible again. You know, a few more years and we might be able to have another chance at a PU. Probably not, but maybe. It's always possible. It's always possible. Uh, idea group at next level. It's definitely going to be admin. Well, I don't know. I'm almost considering it that maybe it should be um, a military one because we're so far ahead. But no, we, we, need, um, we need stuff, you know. We need stuff. Uh, okay, Eastern Hussar... We don't have to give them all of it. We could take one for ourselves. And, in fact, I kind of feel like maybe we should just take Yiddish school, because otherwise, you know. Yeah. Oh, no, no, not that. Same thing. Yeah, I, I think we should just take one. It's going to be a little bit border gory for now, but this doesn't matter. We're about to annex them. This is the last bit of land. We're going to feed uh, this vassal. So, I think it works. Everything's still connected up. It's fine. Um, yeah. Uh, 
And now we have all of our land around the Black Sea connected up. That, and that is super, super convenient. That's the main thing I like about it. Mm -hmm. I think really we just want to wait until the the Mamluks get themselves into a into a pickle, you know, wait until they declare a war that they are gonna lose, like um, like against Kara, be most likely. But well, even that probably is not gonna happen. But Tunis maybe, yeah, Aragon. Wait till they're in trouble, and then we'll, we might have an opportunity. Oh, colonialism is going to take forever, man. Okay. You still don't even have some of the stuff as cores, really? Okay. Well, that's fine. Hmm. What else do we want to be doing right now? I suppose we could get claims on Aragon. I don't want to get too many, because I want to get that mission, really, but it's not going to be an option as long as Hungary owns this one province. It sucks that they got that early on. That's one of the only annoying things that's really stopping us from progressing even quicker. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, I mean, I suppose... Why are we losing so much money now? Army maintenance? Uh, that doesn't seem right. Well, no, it does seem right. We built more cannons and more artillery, and or the same thing. Uh, you know what I mean. Um, cavalry and everything. That's got to be what it is. And uh, fleet maintenance is probably a little bit on top of that. Let's go to Mothball again. Let's make some money. Mm-hmm. Truce of Lithuania has ended. I don't expect that a coalition is going to form, but one might. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we have five slots. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> So Trebizond, I'm going to start annexing you soon, but I want to do Moldavia at the same time. And we'll try to get new vassals soon as well. I think Armenia is going to be a perma vassal in the southeast. And uh, other than that, I don't know. I don't know. Hold on, I want to check something. What other states can we make? Room, definitely want to do that. That's going to be, it's going to be a good state, and it already is. So let's do that. Uh, beyond that, Boigas. The Boigas probably want some more land. Like Ragusa, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, we'll create as well. Mm-hmm. Burgundy, England, and France are all without heirs. That's kind of uh, intense. That seems... That's strange. <laughs> de Avis, de Trastamara, that would be terrifying. And de Bourgogne. So, okay, so France might... Uh, eventually end up a PU of Aragon, and that is going to be... If that happens, ooh, that's going to be terrible. That would be the worst. That would be absolutely just the worst. Oh, it was prestige for that, yeah. 
Okay. 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 What else can we do? Let's go. You're ready to fight. To fight anyways, it seems. Hmm. We could definitely mothball our forts. No reason not to do that. And not do that really. Okay, they started a core there now. All right. They have promoted Crimea as well, which makes sense. Obviously, that's not going to matter once we get it. We don't have it promoted, but still, it's uh, good to know that they are playing smart. Oh gosh, we're using a lot of money on missionaries. What, what are we converting? Ragusa. Why is it so much? Isn't Ragusa a state? Why do the missionary cost so much? Why does that cost so much? <laughs> um, that seems ridiculous. All of those actually seem pretty high. I guess this is the development, right? Yeah, that's right. Mm. No thanks, then. No thanks. I'll do that one, though. A good province to grab if we have a chance. Uh, do, 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 do. And then that I think is gonna be all we do for there. Other than that, we have permanent claims on Kataman, nothing else to worry about there, really. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, I tell you what, I think this is gonna be where I take a break or possibly end it. Let me, I'm gonna check real quick. One last thing. What I've been checking on Twitter is to see if there's this, uh, if uh, one of my favorite YouTubers, Matt Colville, is going to be doing any streams tonight. I'm going to see, and if he is, then um, uh, he hasn't tweeted anything, so I'm going to assume, I'm not going to assume he is. Um, in any case, I think I'm going to take a break here. I think I'm going to take a break, go get some food. And then, uh, and then come back and continue, you know? Uh, I don't know what we'll actually do, but we'll do something. <laughs> Ragusa probably would be one of the options. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. I think I'm going to take a break here.